Well, hey everyone, and welcome to our physics homework tutorial. Uh, we hope you find this tutorial helpful in your study of physics, and if you do, please visit our website at www.physicsvodcast.com. There you're going to find over 200 physics examples in every topic of physics. Uh, it's sure to help you get through that physics homework. We'll see you then! here. We're going to look at some electron transitions in this problem. So let's use the energy level diagram for hydrogen to determine the wavelength and color of a photon emitted by an electron transition. It's going to take us from the fourth to the second energy level. So you'll see over here on the right hand side we have the energy values for hydrogen. So we're going to want to use our equation, which basically says that the energy is equal to H times C divided by the wavelength. Um, the energy that we're looking at here is the energy that we go, um, that is given off when we go from the fourth to the second energy level. So to find that energy value, we are going to simply subtract those two energies and in doing that you'll get an energy value of 2.55 electron volts. We can then put that into our equation for E. H and C are just constants. Those two constants multiplied together are equal to 1240 uh, when we're using the electron volt conversion there for H and we're trying to find the wavelength. So doing a little mathematics here, when we solve for wavelength we get a wavelength of 486 nanometers. Now the second part of the qu question asks what color of light would be emitted? So if we look on our spectrum the 486 nanometer wavelength corresponds to a light that is in the blue or violet range of light color.